This fact is maddening to many families. Unemployment benefits are taxable income. At the federal level. Um, in California, California doesn't tax unemployment benefits on your state return, so that's good news, yeah. Uh, but on your federal return, they're taxable. Here's how to report unemployment income on your federal tax forms. First, you should receive this, a 1099-G form by mail. It looks a lot like a W-2, but it's from the state. The boxes below will show you how much you collected and how much the state took out in taxes, if any. You might be able to access your 1099-G online. Warning. The state says if you see a $0 amount on your online form, your form has not yet been processed. Check back later for updates. Once you have real numbers, you'll have to feed them into your return. If you have tax software, it should walk you through the process. Side note, if your family's income is $72,000 or less, you might be able to have your taxes figured and filed for free. Go to irs.gov and look for free file. If you do your taxes by hand, on paper, which more than 15 million people did last year. There's more work than just the standard 1040 form. You'll need to attach Schedule 1 and write your unemployment income on Line 7. Then, if the state deducted federal tax for you, that amount goes on the main 1040 form, Line 25B. You could end up owing a little bit when you file your return. More often though, it just reduces your refund a little bit. If the state didn't take out any federal tax and you're still collecting unemployment benefits, you can change that for this year. If you're frustrated that the IRS considers unemployment benefits taxable income, don't get upset with the tax man. Vent your frustration to Congress. They're the ones who write the tax code that the IRS then follows. So if you think unemployment benefits should be tax-free, let your representative and senators know. An easy way to look them up is govtrack.us. There's a search bar on the homepage.